I'm really pleased to present an interview that I recorded with the British Canadian high mezzo soprano and singing teacher Sarah Champion. Now, unfortunately, there is a little bit of a twist. I did have a little bit of a technical problem when I was saving the file, but what I have done instead is I have written up what we discussed in the interview in a blog form. So if you would like to go to the Talking Classical blog, which is Talking Classical Podcast. WordPress.com. You can read the interview there. Lots of really interesting things to say, particularly about contemporary opera, as Sarah works a lot in that field, and some of the um, the, the processes when she goes about memorising scores and performing with her colleagues. And she also discussed um, some of the processes that go into teaching singing, which I'm sure will be of real interest to a lot of you listening to this. So a big thank you to Sarah for very kindly taking the time time out of her schedule on her off day to talk to me. Don't forget that you can also catch up with the interview that I recorded with British concert pianist James Lisney. He's got a fantastic concert series coming up this autumn uh, called Endgame, which aims to explore the idea of the late style through some of the most iconic piano works of Haydn, Beethoven, Schubert and Chopin. He had some really interesting things to say about the um, the performance practice and aesthetics of that particular sort of repertoire. Really interesting insights as well about the music profession and the music educational system. Um, please do go and listen to that. I'd also like to draw your attention to World Mental Health Day, which takes place on Thursday the 10th of October. It's a day that's organised by the World Health Organisation, which aims to promote mental health awareness around the world and good mental health practice internationally. Some of you may remember that a few months ago I recorded an interview with Lucy Thraves, who is the editor of Classical Music magazine. Classical Music is having a year-long campaign called Harmony in Mind, which aims to promote good mental health practice and raise awareness of mental health within the classical music sector. Lucy had some really, really thought-provoking insights about mental health within the industry and she provided us with lots of facts. Definitely worth listening to um, next week on World Mental Health Day and in the build-up, it's a topic that definitely needs to be talked about a lot more today and um, no one should ever feel ashamed admitting to having a mental health problem. Um, All of us have mental health, all of us have brains, all of us have thoughts, all of us have emotions. And I've also included in that interview some links to various hotlines and resources which you can access if you are affected by any of the issues in that interview or if you're someone who is experiencing or if you know of anyone who is experiencing experiencing a mental health problem at the moment, then I would really urge you to access those resources as I can definitely tell you they are so, so helpful.